Steph Curry signed a $62 million contract extension for one year, extending his contract with Golden State until 2027. Hopefully, the world still exists then, and Steph will still be a warrior for life. One thing is for sure, he cannot be traded until next year. He is the only player with a single-year contract in the $60 million range, but many players have reached $60 million in the last year of their signed contracts. For Steph, he will have a standalone $60 million contract, and he will also have a total of $178 million over three years. He will still be the highest paid player per year in his contract until he retires or finishes the last year of the contract he signed. Since Steph is already signed and secured, I'm just waiting for Jonathan Kuminga to be given a contract. The Golden State is aligning contracts for veterans and young players to avoid a situation where their team is loaded with big contracts while still in the rebuilding process. Starting from 2020, the new decade or era, the highest paid player in career earnings is Kevin Garnett, followed by Kobe, LeBron, Shaq, and CP3. After four years, Kevin Garnett is number eight in the career earnings standings. According to Bobby Marks, three players have reached half a billion in career earnings. LeBron, with a total of $580 million. Steph, who will have a total of $532 million after signing his contract extension. And Kevin Durant, who so far is yet to sign an extension, but will reach that amount. As of now, Kevin Durant is at $499.8 million. Technically, Kevin Durant is also included because a $59 million extension is pending for him for one year, as long as he doesn't move to another team. He's the only one capable of doing that. The fourth player to reach $500 million in earnings is Paul George, who will have a total of $516 million when his career ends, unless it decreases if PG is waived or bought out by Philadelphia or whichever team he ends up with. However, due to the large contracts being given now, LeBron, KD, Steph, and Paul George won't stay long in the rankings. If Luka and Jokic sign max contracts, they will immediately be on top. Giannis still has a flexible contract, and when the three years are up, he can sign for another four years. European players will still be on top of the rankings when it comes to the biggest contracts. They will also reach $600 million in their total earnings. What do you think about this, friends? Just comment below and subscribe as well.